Halfway proof. Hi, I'm Cecil Castellucci, and I'm the author of Boy Proof. And um, I wanted to say about Boy Proof that I think that um, it's a book that's um, you know talks about fandom and fangirls and uh, the nature of uh, moving from sort of fantasy to the real world. You know, um, I think that science fiction and fantasy is a big part of my life, and so. Uh, I wanted to write a book that sort of reflected that because I don't think that there are many books about that that address the girl fan. And um, she's also, she's a smart person and she's very much an individual but doesn't really know how to be an individual yet. And um, I think that I was interested in capturing the moment where all those things come together. Anyway, I live in Hollywood and um, so, uh, uh, you know, I got to meet Rick Baker once when I got to try on a mask for Planet of the Apes. Um, I didn't get to be an ape extra, and I'm sure that um, Tim Burton is crying because of that. That would have been awesome. But um, uh, so that was the inspiration for Egg's dad. And um, there's also, I got to see some footage of some fangirls um, who were obsessed with The Matrix. And there was this one girl that I saw, and um, she was just amazing. And uh, she was dressed up like Trinity. And I just thought, wow, I really want to, um, I really want to write about her because she was so smart, and um, she said that the Matrix was forever. But you kind of knew that that one day the Matrix wasn't going to be forever. And um, I just thought about that sort of love that you have for something, that sort of obsession. You know, certainly for me, it was Star Wars was a big thing for me, and um, and I think that you know that's a part of growing up, sort of like really finding something that you love that is yours, you know, whether it be music or um, a, band, a you know, band or a, a movie or a book or whatever. So, um, also the title Boy Proof, just in case you're wondering, comes from my friend Steve who works at um, Skylight Books, which is a Book Sense independent book store in Los Feliz in Los Angeles. And um, he told me that I should write a book called Boy Proof. And um, all of a sudden, egg came into my head and uh, I just thought I'm gonna marry all these different elements that uh, that I have thanks there'll be better t-shirts at a different point <laughs>